our Tauruses. We're from the Tauruses from October the 10th to the 14th. We're from the Do Your Reading. Got it already laid out, ready for you. Already laid out, ready for you. But first of all, I want to ask y'all a good favor. Could y'all like, subscribe to my channel? I really appreciate it. And if you want to, at the end of the, there's going to be where you can donate if you want to donate to this channel. I appreciate that too. Anything counts. I'm not being specific because there ain't no specifics to it. Because I'm grateful for what people do for me in this channel to get it going. And I want to tell y'all that I appreciate y'all. And I thank y'all for even listening to me. Because you don't even got to listen. You know, so I thank you for taking the time to out your day and listening to me. So let's get started. The first day we got is the 10th. It looks like you're playing it safe. You're sitting at this table. You see what's going on around you. All the stuff steaming up in the, in the landscape, but you're ignoring the fact to what's going on in the background. You got to set your intention to what you're doing, you know what I'm saying? But it's all in the background. It's just lit up like a Christmas tree and you're sitting over like, oh, I don't hear anything. I'm just playing it safe. Like if you, if you had a firecracker, you blow up. But I'm just playing it safe. <laughs> Let's go to the next day, which is the, the 11th. The 11th, you got peace. You're feeling peace, because look at you. You like your peace and you're in the clouds and stuff and you're all in comfortable peace. You're having such a peaceful moment and you feel so peaceful and nobody can interrupt your peace. Okay, then let's go to the uh, 12th. You have friends and colleagues. Look like they're going to have something and you're going to get together and y'all going to be hanging all out and just chilling with your friends and the colleague and get to know people and just be out there and enjoying your life and the events and three and with three other people, three or more people. Then we got the on, on the uh, 13th, we got travel. Looks like you're wanting to travel somewhere, but the suitcase at the door, that means you ain't went yet. You're just, you're making plans to go traveling or go somewhere you want to you that you're going to be i say around in the around the, on the holidays you'll be going somewhere okay the 14th we have two cards came out which we have the dark thoughts look like you're all in your head with some thoughts you're thinking things that you shouldn't think you shouldn't be thinking dark thoughts but just you're all in your head you're going to consciousness as you just you're giving you dark and scary stuff that you're getting into. Then you got the healing light they're sending. It's because your body is needing some healing. Need to eat right. Need to try to energize your exercise. You need to try to heal yourself. You know, keep your body right to heal the inside and out. Instead of ignoring the fact of what I'm doing. It's easy to do because everybody likes cupcakes. Everybody likes all that, but they don't want to do the hard work to bottom line okay don't want to do the hard work let's see if there's anything else is there anything else you'd like to tell my dear and lovely Tauruses that with there anything else you'd like to tell with my lovely Taurus oh boy, I'm so glad to stay and see y'all put up with me anything else let's see oh we have new new supportive connections look like you're going to be meeting new people and you're going to get different supportive connections to other things in your life you might be creating some might have a job prospect but there's new things coming to your horizon that you're not going to be aware of then you need to ask the angels for, for direction to where you should go and what you should do. You need to ask, because it's like going to be ask spirit. Four occasions, you need to ask spirit about abundance. You have fears about a job. You need to talk dear to your gracious father and the heaven and the God that you serve to send his angels to help you, to guide you through the things you need. The next card we have is Ascendant Masters. Um, 
Ascended Masters. Let me see something. I'm trying to make sure I'm saying this right. Ascended Masters. If I can find it. Ascended Masters. 174. 174. Let's see what it has to say. Ascended Masters in the upright position, which it was. Okay, the spirit world is filled with dynamic entities who long to assist you in all your areas of your life. Some of these are ascended masters, those who have lived on the earth, the plane before, and now works from the energetic realm. This card is telling you to look out, look at your life and open up to the master that most recognize you recognize with the solution you seeking at this time in the upright position this card is bearing you with precious and high masters of enlightenment including jesus buddy and the others of the profound spiritual influences in the world jesus represents represents the door that comes with unlimited healing power no matter what your religion, pleasure it may be. He can bring you miracles, assist with physical, mental, or, or emotional healing. As a master of love, he can open your heart to expecting the unconditional love that you deserve for yourself. Deep, 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 deep. How low do you want to go? How low do I want to go? Do you want me to tell you some more? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Okay, so we're going to pull another card. Anything else that you would like to tell me about this spread? Let's see. Hold on. Let's see. We'll get these other cards to see. Anything else you have to say to my Tauruses? Anything else that need to be said for my Tauruses? And second in command, my Taurus is how you do. Hallelujah. 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 Do not ask me by I said grace Lord, grace Lord, do not pass me by make it sound like church up in here don't it amen Jesus loves me, yes I know, for the Bible tells me so. Yes, the one that leads me, Jesus loves me till I set free. Amen. I said amen. Okay, here we go. Let's see, is there anything that's on the spread that we needed to, to assist Taurus that they need to know? Hold on, these cards here for a mess. They shut me up, but I like them because they kind of eat. They help you, and this is what I started with. Okay, basically, we had the Queen of Coins upside down. False prosperity, suspensions, responsibilities, neglected person, untrusted person, fear of failure. You fear to fail. Let me tell you something. Keep, you can't keep fearing to fail. Then you have the Seven of Cups. Desire, determination, strong willpower, a goal, nearly attained, intelligent choice. You got to put that you desire and you will and your resolution. You have to desire it. You have to manifest. You have to believe that you're going to make it. You got to believe in what you're doing to make it succeed. Then we're going to pull two more cards. It's seven of wands upside down. Uh, you got some anxiety, embarrassment, indecision, hastiness, Causes, losses, uncertainty, prosperity, and doubt. Then we also got unexpected change, quarrels, breakups with personal relationships, rupture, disconnect. It's going to be a lot of those. 
people saying, bye, oh, bye. I said, bye, oh, bye. See you when you get back home. Let's see, anything else you'd like to say to my Tauruses? Anything else? Messages they got. Okay, it says the uh, the page of cups. You have inconclusive. You have temporary distraction, seduction, and flattery over over dependent on loved ones. You better learn to depend on yourself, cause it's kind of like this when you got it hard, you gotta fix it yourself, cause then you understand what you did. Then we got uh, the Knight of Coins upside down, which we got stagnant, carelessness, lack of determination or direction, narrow-mindedness, and dominant view illness. You know, like illness, you got ill, ill. Then you got, okay, we got the Ten of Swords, benefit, profit, temporary gain, improvement, passment, passing success, temporary favor, monetary advancements. You got possibilities in the bank possibilities in the bank I got possibilities in the bank oh lord yeah I got possibilities in the bank yeah there's some money waiting on me yeah, yeah. I said possibilities in the bank for my lord Yes, possibilities in the bay. Ooh, and then you gotta understand me. Mm -hmm. So if you wanna sit here and cry, oh, pick up your clothes and go. I said, I, 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 well, I gotta go. Mm -hmm. I see you on the other side of the road. Mm -hmm. Cause when God calls me, I'll be gone. I'm a leaving, I'm a be free. Mm. Take me to the another place. Uh, but I'm gonna be free, 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 free. And that's all I need. I'm gonna be free and find me a place to live. I, I'm gonna walk on downtown. Uh, and I know I gotta be free for my Lord. I don't mean to bore y'all. I ain't no natural born singer, but sometimes things come to you and it just says, sing it, sing it, sing it, sing it. And that's what I did. And then you got the eight of swords come out. You got crisis, conflicts, domination, imprisonment, terminal, bad news, censor, criticism, sickness, karma, misfortune can end in opportunity. Somebody could be going to jail or you hear about it. Uh, so be careful on what you're doing, what you're involved in, because I'm telling you something. Everything got to catch. If you're going to play ball, don't be the one to catch it because I'm not doing it. I'm not just, I don't snitch. I don't know. I just do my time because I ain't doing it because I know the cost behind it. Ain't nobody worth me being in the ground before I want to be. I'm not stupid. Ain't nothing stupid about me. That's the way my mama raised me, and that's the way I see things, baby. In a story. Now, like I said, this is your reading, and I want to thank y'all for joining me, and I also want to say don't forget, at the end of this, you can donate to my channel if you would like to help out with it or whatever that you would like to do. Or you would like to, it's so embarrassing, you know, not just to ask, but it is okay to ask. I had to tell myself that. It's not embarrassing to ask people for help. When you don't ask, you don't eat. You don't get fed. Simple as that is what I always told. And also, I want to tell y'all thank you and I appreciate y'all. And push like, share, and comment. Because when it floats around, the better it is for me. Thank you and God bless y'all. And y'all have a viable, I mean viable, and a viable day. Okay? Love y'all. Peace.